it's uh, it's called Lost in Transit, and uh, it's on at the Brighton Spiegel tent, full, full of performers, from uh, May the 18th to May the 24th, uh, every night at nine. With a ma thank you very much, Michaela, with a with a, a matinee at, on Saturday afternoon, and uh, it's we bought it last year and we're bringing it back again. We've changed it. We've added a twist. We've added some extra elements and uh, we're very pleased with it, very excited and Jackie Lee did the first show with us this year and then had to go to another show so Aurelie kindly stepped in. This is our new, our new edition Aurelie, we're very happy to have her. We're behind the case so it's coming, and it's coming this way so you're walking back. It's, uh, it's great, it's really interesting, I don't know it all yet. <laughs> So I'm coming back tomorrow to learn a bit more. This is her first day, so yeah. there's some things we've kept exactly the same, really popular suitcase dance, but then other things we've we've kind of added in and of course each performer brings their own. So Aurelie's brought her own hoop act and her own contortion act. And it works like that, it's modular, we swap people in and out. So uh, yeah, no, it's working nice. It's about the trials and tribulations that occur to almost every one of us when we go travelling. So it's non-specific, but the story follows Marion, who is the, the girl in the blue coat, and her adventure through some exotic transit. It's not necessarily a station or an airport or underground or barn. You know, it could be anywhere, but it's just the things that happen, the tickets that get lost, the suitcases that get mislaid, the passports that don't work, the customs that get in your fact, You know, everything that can go wrong goes wrong, and then it follows her journey through that and her escape from it in the end. I've, uh, I've put myself in it because last year I watched it, I directed, I don't think you can direct and be in, so it was enough for me to direct last year and do the sound and uh, this year I've decided to put myself, because I am a performer basically, so I kind of wanted to put myself in it and uh, it's working well, it's nice. Uh, we felt that we wanted some songs in it and uh, Bear works with me and my other company, the Classerati, as a drummer and uh, I heard her singing and thought, wow, this would be great to put this in. So she's got a gorgeous voice and we've added that into the mix. Well, we hope that from here people will see it. We'll have, you know, interested industry people come. And uh, the idea is that they see it and we can go to their Spiegel tent. It's designed to go into Spiegel tents. It could also go into theatres. I mean, that's my background. With Dwar we played circus in theatres and I wanted to really explore that. I think that's missing. So um, hopefully we, we will attract some industry interest. That's why we're here. And uh, then we'll move on. We've already had a, some interest from Melbourne. I've got to do anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> Obviously we'll be sacking Michaela as soon as we can. The uh, girls are really at the top of their profession. We've got Michaela come from Cirque du Soleil. Vicky is there walking behind us and Aurelie who we've just met.